Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm your host Anna. My channel name is Only My Dreams. Today we're doing a Dollar Tree haul, baby. Everything is a dollar twenty-five each, and it is from Waldorf, Maryland, in um the the store next to the Rainbow. That's where I got all the stuff from. Is from that one in particular store. Now, please know I still have the hand of friendship as the challenge is going on. That is still happening for USA and Canada. Only eighteen years are up. There's going to be one random winner as of right now if I get a whole bunch of more hands it'll go up to two or three more random winners and I've already shared some of the items that I'll be giving away to that winner if you'd like to be a part of it go check it out down there below I'll put down some videos so you guys can go check them out and check out my friend mail you'll see the different variations of the Hannah friendship and how they're coming in and they're coming in um, decorated in different ways you put your name and your address your favorite color your favorite movie it's just a way for me to get to know you a little bit better and bring a little closer to me for my um, travels here on YouTube six plus years okay and I'm going to be putting them all inside of a really nice um, photo album okay you can go check out my other videos as well I've been doing perfume reviews I've been doing happy planners weekly um, I do Timu Sheen is coming up Sheen is coming up I have a big old order a huge order I did from Shein and um, go check out my other videos, including our cousin chats with Karen from K is for Karen, where we talk about everything from A to Z, no holds barred. So go check that out. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into the food because um, right now, you know, everything is kind of crazy in the world. It's really important to get our homes prepared and get our pantries um, stocked up, well stocked up for, you know, some uncertain times okay so I'm gonna share with you the things I picked up this time around I found the pace red enchilada sauce in the mild and I think it's a 10 ounce is it a 10 ounce 10.5 ounce they have that available right now it is a pop top okay and then they got the best by date for this is March of 2024 so I got one of those I'm gonna drop them here in my Aldi's bag so I can go back downstairs. I got another can of the Margaret Holmes seasoned collard greens. Okay. And this is a 14.5. This is Southern style, I believe. I think it says Southern style right there. Real Southern style. And um, again, the best by date. It's a really good one. If I didn't already say it, is 2026 of June. Really good date. All right, so I got one of those, and this is a product of USA. I just noticed a little flag. This is a USA product, so if you see these and you're trying to do USA, Margaret Holmes is the way to go. Then I did pick up some Rotel, the original diced tomato with green chilies. It has the best by date of April of 2024. And it is a 10 ounce, so this is just a nice one to have. Now, as far as prepping is concerned, I always try to give some hints and tips sometimes you know here and there um tomato products anything that has a high acidity including fruits and what have you they don't last very long in cans um if you can find them better in glass jars you're better off in a glass jar with those type of high acidic foods because they will eat through the can so these are not really good long term at all um you should really just make sure you rotate these you know pretty swiftly just because of their high acidic rate just a heads up okay then i got the campbell's spaghettios and they have them in a chicken with meatball okay this is a 15.6 ounce and it is in a tomato sauce does have a pop top and she looks like that and the best by date is november of 2024 so this is another one that has a really good date okay okay it's part of franco america okay i was looking at i was like what is that saying right there franco america okay this is the campbell spaghetti and this is in a tomato with cheese sauce and it is a 15.8 ounce it does have a pop top to it pop top and then the best by date for this one is November of 2024. So I got one of these. Again, I always say slow, slow and steady wins the race as far as these kind of um, cans and these kind of foods. You know, you just add a little bit here, a little bit there. 
if you're starting to stock your pantry and you want to have several weeks or several months or even up to a year of rotational food. A um, little bit goes a long way when you, you know, keep adding. Um, this is the Kelowna flavored Italian style breadcrumb. They also did have um, the panko. So next time I'll pick up the panko and this best by date is 2025. But I think I don't like this container because it's like a paper container. I really want to transfer it into something different. I'll probably transfer it into one of my ball jars. Um, it'll last longer. Then I did also find some more of the Hormel pepperoni, which is awesome. I love that. Um, these go for a lot more in the stores. A lot more to get to. Super happy to have found those there. And the best by date for these are uh, December 2023. Um, my kids like to make their little mini pizzas with these, but they also put them in sandwiches, okay? So you can use them in a lot of different ways. So there you go. As for the Kishon. Oh, and then I was really happy to have found these. The family size. Yeah, I haven't seen, honestly, a full size cereal at my Dollar Trees in a really, 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 really long time. I know a lot of you have found a whole bunch of different kinds, including Chex and Cheerios. My stores just haven't had them. They haven't. So it was nice to have found the red, white, and blue Captain Crunch. I did buy two family size, which is awesome. We are family of six. Um, this is a one pounder here, 16.9 ounce, just a little bit over a pound. Um, so they already got into one <laughs> since I walked in. They're like, was there any new cereal? And I was like, yeah, actually. And they had some and they like it. So there you go. They have that available right now. Nice big one. And the best by date, I didn't say, is January of 2024. So there you go for $1.25. That's a really good find. And then the last, well, no. I thought it was, I, I have a couple more foodie things. <gasps> I got some Rice Krispies. They have them in a three pack. Um, these are a little bit larger, you know. Uh, I like the fact that they're, they're in a three pack, so it's perfect for my boys. One each. Boom. One and done. So they have them available right now like that. Then I did get a Milky Way and a Snickers. Again, these come like in a five, one, let me see, one, two, three, four, five, six. And there's six of us here in the family. So it's like one each and it's done. The whole bag is gone. <laughs> it's like, you know, boom. Yeah, so I got these. Okay, now, just so you know, I've been enjoying the Home Glow Apple Current. Um, I also got the Tahitian. I shared this in another haul. Go check out my last Dollar Tree haul. I found some really great mugs. They were amazing. I'll try to, you know, put those videos so you could see them down there below. But there you go. I use this in my room. I've been using it. I just sprayed it today, actually, in here. The Apple Current. It gives me just wonderful autumn vibes and I'm loving it. Now, if you are a dollhouse miniaturist or you want to get your feet wet, um, this, okay. I did a DIY two part or two video on how to make this. Um, this was a picture frame from the Dollar Tree that I got as a gift from Diane from D. Valence. Um, it was a Mother's Day, uh, gift exchange that case for Karen had hosted. And this was one of my gifts. So I put down the information here with the picture that I cut out out of my um, book once you see the videos. But I made a small vignette here. Um, go like this. A small vignette. Dollhouse miniature small vignette that I could put up on a wall and it won't take up a whole lot of space. So if those of you that want to do something like this, you see how thin it is. It doesn't take up a lot of space. I used what I had here at home. Didn't spend any extra money. Um, and I, th I felt like it came out really nice. And it was all, almost made all out of paper, except for the three, four dollhouse miniature pieces, the tables, paper, everything else is paper. Um, yeah, so go check those out. I just released those this week. Then I'm going to be making some jewelry out of my bargain bead box 
jewelry I just shared as a monthly subscription that I get. I'm going to be making some jewelry and sharing the finished jewelry with you guys. So be on the lookout for that as well. Okay. Uh, socks. School's about to start. Um, I don't know what happens in this house. It's like the walls eat the socks. It's crazy. Well, they had some of those cute little socks. They didn't have all of them. They didn't. But I did get one of the Yahoo. And this is the only one that they had. It was kind of, you know, hidden a little bit. So I got one. I thought it was kind of cute. Then I was able to find the Hershey's Kiss. And then I love these for the twins, uh, the Oscar Mayer, and they didn't have any more. These are all they had left. And the, I asked the, the young lady there, she was like, everybody grabbed them up yesterday. <laughs> I was like, really? She said, like, yeah, they all grabbed them up. Everybody that came into the store yesterday grabbed them up. So I was like, yeah, I was a day late. It's okay though. Um, but this is so stinking cute with the Oscar Mayer wiener. <laughs> I love that. So I was able at least to get these, which are, you know, really cool and super cute. Twins are going to love it. Then I was able to find a Pro Sprints Performance. These will be for Little Frank. They are a three-pack. They're really nice and thick. And I think these are the ones from Payless. Yeah, when, you know, when Payless was open. Um, yeah, these came originally from Payless. I don't know how much they would originally go for. But Payless is closed. They're no longer around, at least not around here. Uh, so I was happy to have found those. And they're again, the socks are very good, high quality. So I found two packs. And they are size uh, 6 through 10 shoe size. So that'll fit my son just fine. And they're men's crew. And if you want to see the difference between, like, you know, one of these little socks versus how thick one of those socks are there's a really big difference. So super happy to have found those. Be on the lookout if you have kiddos starting school and you're trying to get new socks. Then I found the mini, the mini C three pair. I found one of these. Um, so I picked that up. This is like a thinner, almost, I consider it almost like a trouser sock, but it's not, you know what I'm saying? It's not, it's a little bit thicker than a trouser sock, but not as thick as a regular sock. It's in, in that in-between zone, which is really weird. But this also was not Dollar Tree. So that was a nice one. Fine. And my kids will use these because they're just white socks. They'll be good to go, honey. Okay. Then the next thing I wanted to share was in the autumn department. They had this. So they got some new autumn, autumn home decor items out. And I'm still on a hunt. I'm trying to find like the perfect little rolly cart for my coffee station for my bedroom. And I wanted to add this to it. I thought it was so cute. Now, when they had three different variations of this with different little scenes, but a lot of these little center parts were crooked. They weren't aligned straight. So make sure you pay attention to that. But this is just adorable. And it'll look so charming with the coffee cart, you know, and hot cocoa and coffee. It'll look so cute. And it says autumn leaves and lattes, please. Yeah, so I'm excited to, yay, find a cart and get my little, my little coffee station on. Then in the kitchen department, they have the Natural Home Brands Reusable Veggie Bags. And this is not Dollar Tree. It is not. Uh, and it looks like this. I got two of them. So they're basically reusable mesh bags. So you get four 11 by 14 bags and one 7.75 by 7.75. So there's five bags in total. Um, and I'm looking forward because our vegetables, we go through vegetables. It's like the vegetables that we buy, they just don't last long at all. So I told my husband from now on, just don't buy what we can use within one or two days. And then we just have to keep going back to the store because it won't last even five or, or six days now. They just go bad that quickly. The quality has just been really bad. Um, so I was happy to find these. And these are, again, reusable and good for the earth by Natural Home Brands. So 
take a peek at those in your kitchen department. Then in the beauty, uh-oh, I'm missing a thing here. So behind here. Oh, looks like I'm missing something. In the beauty department, okay, they have these aromatherapy signature lotions. Um, they have four different variations. I did buy two. I don't see the other one here in front of me, so it might have might have fell out of the bag in the car. Um, this one is not Dollar Tree brand. And it this one's called Lemon Verbena. And then the other one that I got is it's four different fl flavors, four different scents. So I'm going to try this with you right now to tell you if it's even worth the money. And I couldn't smell it or anything because it was sealed. And I wasn't going to be one of, one of those people, you know, that rips off a seal and uses it and puts it back. Uh, I don't do that. I will open up a container and see if it smells good, but I'm not going to rip off like a straight up seal because this was straight up seal. See, I had to unseal it. Okay. So let's see. This one's Verbena. Ooh. It's, well, there you go. It's watery. It's, well, yeah, it's watery. Yeah, it's watery. But it smells really good. It's it, it's on a watery, you know, when it's cheaper and it's on a watery side. And it kind of just dissipates quickly. That's what's happening here. Um, but it still feels good. The scent is very strong as soon as you put it on. But now it's barely there. So I'm glad I only got two because I would definitely just use these on my legs or something and on my feet because um, it's not a really thick cream or anything. So it'll dry up pretty quickly. Okay. So it's called Aromatherapy Signature. Uh, yeah, I don't really smell it anymore now. So it's very short lived. Uh, I don't know. I just wouldn't buy it. I wouldn't buy it. It's not. I don't recommend it. Personal opinion. That's just for the lemon verbena. There's three other kind. I do have one other one. It might be a little bit different as far as the scent is concerned. But now I don't even smell it. Moving on. Barbasol. They have the precision and nail clippers. I just shared. I don't know. Did she take it already? I think she took it. Because I had them here for my daughter. I just bought the clippers. Not clippers, the the tweezers. Yes, yeah, she took it already. Okay. I told her I left it up here for her. I bought her tweezers, but now they have the precision nail clipper set. And it comes like in a it looks like that. So it has this like, I don't know if it's like a leather-ish anti-slip texture. So it's an anti-slip texture. It's not a case. That's just an anti-slip texture for the top part right there. But they it's a two-pack, which is really nice. There you go. So they have that available. Great stocking stuffer, you know, updating your nail clippers. There you go. And then last but not least is this. Um, this is the Stamina Adjustable Zipper Waist Trimmer. Okay. Um, it fits sizes, waist sizes 28 to 36. Yeah, this is not going to fit me, but I bought it for my daughter. Um, three zipper adjustments, 10 inches wide, made of commercial, no, made of comfortable neoprene material. This is by Microban. Okay. So let's take a peek at her. Let me take it out for you. So let me pull her out. So this is not made for, you know, plus size people. This is kind of made for skinny people already thin people. Yeah, because see how little that is? Again, it's very little. Waist size 28 to 36. Okay, so there's the neoprene, and then here's the three zipper adjustments. So if you're that size and you're looking for a waist trainer, you know, 
you can use this if you're exercising and you're just trying to sweat out some extra water because of neoprene maybe i don't know um and it has a camo look to it which is a little different so you could probably wear it on the outside of your clothes if you wanted to while you're walking around in the house per se i know some women do that but there you go so now you know what it looks like of course this is not made for plus size people it's not it has a slight stretch to it but you know obviously not enough for a true plus size person this is made for people that you know yeah no there you go <laughs> it's not made for plus size gals like me so i'll give this to my daughter see if she wants to try it out if she doesn't want to try it out then we'll probably just donate it and but i thought about her because she was talking about something like that the other day but that is everything for this haul. I hope you guys enjoy it. And uh, be on the lookout for some really cool food finds at your Dollar Tree and get those pantries stocked up. Thank you so much for coming. I'll talk to you later. Bye.